The city of Las Vegas says demand for business licenses, specifically for food trucks, is up. And new business owners tell me that the pandemic gave them the perfect opportunity to follow their food truck dreams. It's a food truck frenzy in the city of Las Vegas. According to the city's business licensing manager, Darcy Adelby Heard, demand for licenses, specifically for food trucks, jumped by about 20% over the past year and a half. It has to do with restaurants were closed for a while, then the city capacities uh, came into play, um, outdoor vending became a big deal, and... Um, and people losing their jobs. And part of the 20%, Hapa Holly's Hawaiian Street Tacos. After nearly two decades of dreaming up a food truck, Gabriel Harvey made it happen in November. I want to spend more time with my family, you know, and when COVID came and people were losing jobs and, and the, the risk of not being able to go to restaurants or going into restaurants and things, I just said, I think it's better if we start a food truck. If it weren't for the pandemic, that dream may not have come true. You get complacent, right, with your, with your job and your career and what you're doing. But this kind of gave me an opportunity to think out of the box, uh, make sure that no matter what happens, I could, you know, I could support my family. And helping make dozens of those dreams come true, Jonathan Ibarra. Everything is built in-house. At Ibarra's food truck builders, Ibarra and a team of about a dozen workers build, lease, and sell food trucks and trailers to Las Vegans breaking into the industry. The biggest thing right now is the rent a food truck. Okay, so this gives uh, people the opportunity to start the business at a very low cost. Since the pandemic started, their hands have been full, going from building about a dozen trailers a year to 20 every three months, completing a single trailer in just three weeks. A lot of these guys, their dreams uh, have, always, have always been to start their own business and their own food trucks, chefs, restaurants, all these things. So by them being you know, laid off, they finally kind of pulled the trigger and went into the food truck. So that really skyrocketed. They're now operating on a 65 trailer wait list. These will be out probably in about the next uh, five to six weeks. And he says there are no signs that this industry, fueled by pandemic passion projects, will slow down anytime soon. Just not be nervous, you know, just kind of go for it. The city of Las Vegas has seen such high demand for these food truck business licenses that they have an entire page on their website specifically dedicated to the industry. Reporting Sophia Paraconi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.